<laughs> Bang! Neves Knives. I'm Jared, and this is the the zero, and the full review is coming up on this tomorrow. But we have a Jack Wolf Knives slip joint sharpshooter right here. Now I'm only doing a first impressions on it because I do need to get it out the door and I don't, I'm not going to have enough time to do a full review comes in this can in the box with a bunch of stuff inside the, the can. Now little backstory while we are um, opening this thing up and checking it out. I seen these guys about a year ago and was in love with, with their designs because there was a couple that were specifically my style and this is a, a traditional a modern traditional knife and that's what I love about it because I love I'm not even a slip joint fan I'm really not but I love modern traditionals where they use new materials titanium m390 things like that and there's a specific kind that I just, I love, and he's got one in his catalog. And I'm going to show you guys that here in one second. So now these will be available April 15th, the sharpshooter. Um, let's uh, open this baby up. That walk and talk. This has one of the sickest grinds I've ever seen on a slip joint. I am in love with this grind. It is a full hollow. It has a nice, thick, strong spine with a tapering tip. I'm not a fan of this blade shape, you know, honestly, but this grind is so thin. This thing is a laser. It is a full hollow, meaning the hollow starts from the top of the spine and swoops inward like this down to the edge. And it is so thin. So thin right here. I mean, it's like paper thin, but I love it that because, you know, a slip joint, obviously, you know, you could do regular cutting with it, but it's great for the detailing work and things like that. And it's got somewhat of like a gun stock handle on it. You know, kind of what I mean is like, it kind of looks like a gun stock. Nice and comfortable in the hand. The fit and finish of this fat carbon fiber and titanium is beautiful. M390 steel. Just gorgeous. This thing is beautiful. Let's listen to that walk and talk. Now, the only thing I would have preferred on this, I do have one complaint, but the one thing I would have preferred on this is a clip. I really like slip joints with a clip. I just do. Like, that's what I mean when I say modern traditional. Now, this is as modern traditional as you can get without the clip, but beautiful execution, man. They they knocked it out of the park with this. Uh, the hardware, I, I think this is a T10, T10 or T12, nice big pivot. Then we have T8s down here. Now, this is my one complaint. These are very shallow T8s. And I'm going to show you really quick. The Knife Buddies, or yeah, Knife Buddies, back in stock. Merry Men EDC, back in stock. They got a couple different colors, and then he's got some raw titanium ones coming soon. And if you don't like the color, he said he always can re it. But let me close this really quick. But if you look at the depth... There's like, there's no depth to that. Come on, let me focus. Sorry, guys. That's it. That's all the way in. There's like no depth to it. So I don't like that. But the big one looks okay. It still looks shallow, but it's big. So it kind of makes sense. But that's, I mean, that's not too bad of a complaint because you really don't take these apart i mean i don't even take slip joints apart really i mean i have but i mean it's not something you commonly do this is beautiful man let's check out the design that got me going crazy about jack wolf knives about a year ago but i couldn't get it because when i went to look or when i went to to try to find it 
they were gone or not gone. They weren't made yet. They were prototypes, but they were unavailable, sold out, whatever you want to call it. I think they were just unavailable. But here's the sharpshooter. This is the one right here that we're looking at right now. And here's the three different colors that it's going to come in. We have the fat carbon fiber, the black micarta, then we have the natural canvas micarta, and the olive drag green canvas. Very nice. Now, this is the one that I'm freaking out about. There's one other one that I'm really in love with too, and I'm trying to decide which one I like better, but the low drag jack. Oh my goodness, I love this. And one of these two my card is right here. Man, I can't decide. Which my card do you guys think would be better? Because I think this my card up is going to be similar to like this. Like meaning this color. And this one I'm not sure yet. Probably more like this. Yeah. But look at that hollow ground spear point blade. That is so beautiful to me. So beautiful. We're going to look at the other designs too. So let me back this up just a little bit. So we got the Vampire Jack. That's a cool. I love that blade shape too. It's another spear point. Um, but it's kind of got like a, a coffin shaped handle. The one thing I really like about the, the, the low drag is that neutral handled shape of the handle oh man that thing looks so comfortable and also i've spoke about this a lot that i really like handles that go from narrow to fat in the back where they go from slim here to thick back here for some reason they just in my hand oh it's so comfortable all right so the other one i really like is this canine so I can't decide which one I like better because I love that 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 spear point blade with that swedge. Let's look at why well, haven't we been pulling up big pictures of it? Oh man, I'm such an idiot. Look at that swedge on the top with that full hollow. Oh, that is so beautiful. Man, with that micarta. Now look at this other micarta. Really nice. All right, so let's check out the Venom Jack now. This one's pretty sick. I kind of like how the handle ta tapers down right there. You know, it kind of seems like your, your pinky could really wrap around it. Warncliffe blade, full hollow again. That would be nasty. Oh, that perfect blade shape for, for, a, war or, sorry, for a slip joint, in my opinion. We got the big bro jack. An another clip point similar to the sharpshooter we have here. Similar to the sharpshooter. Um, see me, I like, if I'm going to have a clip point, I want a straight clip. You know, this has that little, the curl right here where it kind of persians up a little bit. I like them to just be a straight clip. In that case, then I love it. Kind of like this. Straight clip. That I can I can handle. I love that. Um, oh man, sorry guys. Sometimes it goes all the way back on me. All right, so what do we just have? We had the laid back Jack. Now we got the little bro Jack, the little broski. Oh no, that's the one we were just looking at. The little broski. Okay, so we need to go to the. Did we just try out the big bro? No, we just. Okay, so one was the little bro. This is the big bro. Uh, I'm not sure what the difference is. Probably the size. Maybe one's a little bit bigger, but this is his Instagram. That's where I'm clicking on this from. It'll all be linked down in the description for you guys. All right, the Humpback Jack. Let's get to the Humpback Jack now. See, this looks really cool, too. Love the spear point blade. A, quite a bit of belly on that spear point. Not sure how the handle would feel. But, you know, sometimes these the handles that look weird like that, they just seem to work. They seem to work really good. I'm not sure why it keeps taking me all the way back. All right, uh, where were we? We're at the Benny's clip. Another clip point. 
Now, this one has um, not, it doesn't have the full hollow, but beautiful handle. Now, this one, we have the full micarta instead of, you know, the, ha the you know, just the center. So, that's pretty cool. And then, you're going to take me all the way back. To oh, there it goes. Maybe I was doing it wrong the whole time. What an idiot. Next, we have the Javelina. The Javelina Jack. Okay, so now this is more my style of a clip point. Because you have a straight, almost a straight clip. Pretty much a straight clip. Man, the handle looks so nice. I love it. Love it, love it, love it. Let me look at this side. Looks like you got an easy pull or easy, um, because this one, this one, the one thing that's really cool about this one is look at how much room you have to grab. You got a lot. This one looks a little bit tighter. Yeah, that one's a little bit tighter to get to. This one's super easy because you don't have to use your nail. You can literally just pinch it. And the pull is easy from here to here. It's easy. Once you get to here, that's when you got some tension. So it makes it to where it's easy to pull out because once you got it to this point, you can really get a grip if, you know, your fingers aren't the strongest. So this is going to be easy to, to pull out regardless if, you, you know, your fingers are not that strong or if they're really strong. It doesn't matter. <laughs> Beautiful, my card. Oh, look at that. Yeah, I think, I think it's going to be similar to this style just the natural and then the other one will be just like that because look at this or you know what actually it's hard to say i think i yeah i don't know it's hard to say without getting it in hand but man between the low drag and the canine oh i'm in love i'm in love and then you could see the one thing, though, about sharpening this, man, is because look at how narrow this is right here at this neck. Use it as a pointer. Right here at the neck. This is so much broader right here. So sharpening it, you know. But you don't put a low angle on these because it's so thin behind the edge. You could put a high angle on this, and it's still going to cut really good. This is very sharp. The edge is very, very well done. I wish I had time to fully test it, but I honestly, I can tell already that I love it. So I, I don't even need to test it to find out. I'm curious who the OEM is. I'm curious how good the heat treat is on the steel. And that's about all I would really need to test. Um, other than that, man, the fit, the finish, everything else. Oh, let me check out this one. Okay, so this one's a little bit more in there too. <laughs> Where you're not going to have as much room to grab. But it looks like it's still okay. Because like if you look at this one. I can grab it pretty easily right there. You know not right here. Right here. And I don't have an issue. That's me personally. So. Man I'm in love. I'm in love. I'm in love. You guys know me in my spear points. Especially ones like man. Oh, I so sexy and these grinds man they just they look so sexy I, this is like my favorite type of spear point right here because you have the tip you know like similar to like this you know you have that tip where you can use it for utility cuts you got that swedge on top bring a little strength down to the tip but that grind is just so sick. I'm just not a fan of this handle on this one. <laughs> That's me though, man. You know what? And some of the slip joint collectors, you guys will love this. Because it's unique. And it's not the typical. Let's look at the grab on it. And the grab looks like it has a great spot. Because it's below the swoop. Right here. See how it's in front of there? You have plenty of room to grab that. And I'm sure, uh, you know, he's... Uh, Thought this out really good. Man, I want to try this one so bad. Or um, one of them spear point ones. You can see them all right here, how they're kind of positioned. The Venom Jack has a really good grab on it. 
let's check this out really quick. Look at the Venom Jack when it's closed. Oh, man. Look at that grab point. Dang it. Now I'm wanting one of these ones. <sighs> man. I might have to get one of each. I Man, this is just an, a, a beautiful... Man, you know what? If he doesn't make a damn liner lock version of these knives... Where does he live? <laughs> I'm just joking. Um, but man, wouldn't it be awesome to have a liner or like, you know, like a um kind of like Pena does where they uh they have like the front flipper version or you know the top flipper version. Man, that would be so awesome. But uh yeah. Um I, I'm I'm this video's going on long enough, guys. I, I love you guys. Thank you guys for watching. Everything will be linked below. Peace.